In this video, we'll be showing you how to more than double your internal Mac laptop storage capacity with one of our dual drives. The dual drive adds a second internal hard drive to your Mac laptop by replacing your optical drive, which is your CD or DVD drive. With the dual drive, it's possible to get up to 1.5 terabytes of storage in some Mac laptop models. We have two makes of dual drives, one for the MacBook and MacBook Pro unibody models, and one for all other models. This first chart shows you what the total maximum capacity is in the MacBook and MacBook Pro unibody models with our dual drive. You can see that currently in all unibody models, the maximum capacity is 1.25 terabytes. The next chart shows you what the total maximum capacity is in all other models. The MacBook Pro 17 inch has a maximum capacity of 1.5 terabytes, the MacBook and MacBook Pro 15 inch 1.25 terabytes, and all PowerBook and iBook models have a current maximum capacity of 1.07 terabytes. Now we'll show you how easy it is to install a dual drive. If you bought a dual drive with no drive installed, you'll first have to install a drive. First, flip the top plate off of the dual drive. Next, connect your hard drive to the SATA connector in the dual drive. Replace the top plate and screw in the included three Phillips head screws in the top plate. Now, flip the dual drive over and screw in the four included Phillips head screws that anchor the hard drive to the dual drive. For the purpose of this video, we'll show you how to install the dual drive into a 15-inch MacBook Pro. However, the dual drive can be installed in many different models of Mac laptops. We've already removed all the screws holding the top case in place. From this point, flip up the top case and disconnect the trackpad ribbon cable from the logic board. You'll see the optical drive in the bottom right-hand corner of the machine. Begin by removing any tape on the optical drive cable, and then disconnect the optical drive cable from the logic board by gently prying up. Remove the drive by first removing one Torx T6 screw holding the drive to the logic board. Next, remove the three Phillips head screws holding the drive in place. With the screws removed, you can lift the drive up and out of the unit. Disconnect the optical drive cable from your old drive and disconnect the one bracket on the back of your old drive. Reattach the bracket you removed to the back of the dual drive. Now connect your optical drive cable into the dual drive. You can now place a dual drive into your machine. Attach the optical drive cable by pressing down into the connector.
screw in the Torx T6 screw as well as the one Phillips head screw holding the bracket to the logic board. Make sure everything is aligned properly. Put the top case back on the unit, reconnect the cable, and your dual drive has been installed. On your first startup, a dialog box will appear telling you it has found an unrecognized disk. Click Initialize, which will open up Disk Utility. Click on the hard drive from your dual drive. Click on the Erase tab. Click on Erase. Erase again. And your dual drive will be formatted. You'll notice once the format is complete, the dual drive will now be a hard drive icon on your desktop. Performing a get info on the drive will show you all the specs on your newly installed dual drive. Thank you for choosing PowerBookMedic.com